N95 mask has three layers and thus it protects us from infection causing microorganisms. But what is this three layered revision strategy? Chinta mat karo, tum logo ko sab kuch samjha dunga. So three layered revision strategy is a master stroke. It helps you to get your desired result in be it NEET PG, be it INI set or be it FMG. It is a master plan strategy that would help you to revise and stratify your revision with the most high yielding topics you would revise multiple times and it would enhance your PG performance and also your prof exam performance. As the name suggests three layered, so it has three layers. Coming to the first layer. First layer consists of your basic book or your basic subject wise notes. If you are considering your prof exam, it is your book, any standard textbook. But if you are considering for PG entrance examination or FMG, then it is your main subject wise notes. So main subject wise notes, you should read at least once of all the subjects. Okay. And as it is a very much holistic approach, it would overall cover up about 90% of the questions that are going to come in your exam. So the second layer consists of the previous year topics or the PYTs. But from where do you get these PYTs? If you are a Marrow subscriber, you know that the videos having PYT are marked and also the sections where the PYTs are asked, you can get from the Marrow online notes only and you can mark it in your main notes or else I have a list of important topics for NEET PG, INICT and FMG. You can get access to it by joining my YouTube channel. Okay. And you would get access to the premium telegram group where the notes is provided. And there is another separate link in the description box below with which you can get access to the PYTs. Now this PYTs, this would consist of about 60 to 70 percent of the questions that would come in your main exam. Previous year topics are very much important and they help you assess the pitch of the exam. Jaise ki main khilne se pehle bhi na us pitch mein ja ke cricketers practice karte hai na to waisa hi hai previous year topics. Previous year topics padhne se tumko idea aa jayega ki kaun kaun sa topic zyada important hai. So in the second revision, you should study the previous year topics. Okay. You should mark in your main notes and follow those previous year topics. You should read the previous year topics at least two times. Okay. At least two times. Coming to the third layer, that is the most important layer. So the third layer is the previous year questions. In the third layer, you would practice the previous year questions because only reading and not solving MCQs can't help you crack a competitive exam. Okay. So you have to practice the previous year questions. If you are preparing for NEET PG, then past five years of NEET PG, past five years of INI set and three years of FMG. If you are targeting INI set, then at least five years of NEET PG and five years of INI set. If you are targeting for FMG, at least three years of NEET PG, three years of INICT and three years of FMG. Okay. This is the basic funda. You would practice the previous year questions and you would annotate the highlighted points in your notes. Okay. It may be, it, it may be your main notes or it may be your revision notes. From this, you would come across some more topics that were not in the previous year topic list. Okay. And moreover, you would get the buzzwords from this. The buzzwords, you would annotate them so that in the main exam, if the buzzwords come in a long stem of question, then also you can 
मेक इट आउट एंड गिव द करेक्ट शॉर्ट टू द एंसर सो प्रैक्टिसिंग द प्रीवियस ईयर क्वेश्चन इफ यू प्रैक्टिस दैट अमाउंट ऑफ प्रीवियस ईयर क्वेश्चन एज आई हैव सेड then you can easily get 20 to 30 percent of the questions common और थोड़ा घुमा फिरा के अगर पूछेंगे तो फिर about 50 percent also you can get common 40 to 50 percent and this previous year questions annotation you should revise at least thrice at least thrice so this completes the final layer of your revision and if you are practicing for prof exam then in the last layer Uh, replaced by the previous year questions of NEET PG, INSET, and FMG with that of your university exam. Okay, पहला first two को layers same रहेगा main notes या book. उसके बाद previous year topics of your PG exam because in the prof exams only you should start preparing for the PG entrance exam. And in the third layer you would replace the previous year questions of PG entrance. with that of the university exam i hope you have understand the funda the funda is that this stratification that is made it is from low yield topics to higher yield topics and the more number of revisions are concentrated to the higher yield topics okay so first your revision hoga that would be from your main notes second two revisions will be from the previous year topics that you have marked in your main notes and the third revision would be from the previous year questions and the buzz words that you have annotated in your main notes maybe or maybe in your revision notes so this stratification would help you to grasp the important topics and revise them multiple times compared to the lower yielding topics in this year neat pg we have seen the trend that some questions have come in depth and as of now you know that neat pg is more or less a superficial exam it goes about every topics this time it has gone in depth of few topics so for the whole topics like in neat pg and fmg you should have the holistic approach for that is the first reading of complete notes of your complete main notes after that previous year topics and after that the previous year questions and this makes your three layered protection against failure okay i hope you like this video and if you like this video do hit the like button and share it with your friends this strategy is unique so your friend should also know this strategy right and if you are new to my channel and you like my work then do consider subscribing क्योंकि सब्सक्राइब बटन में क्लिक करने के लिए कोई भी लेयर क्रॉस करने का जरूरत नहीं है जस्ट क्लिक इट सो नाउ यू कैन सी टू मोर वीडियोस को वाइज देम नाउ मीन द गॉड्स वॉच ओवर यू